This is the hole the suspects cut through a wall in Sears, making their way into American jewelers, stealing $2 million worth of jewelry. The suspects have entered Sears unlawfully and then breached not only the sheetrock but also a concrete wall that separates the two stores. Police say on Saturday morning, an employee walked into American Jewelers in Town East Mall and saw they had been robbed. I spoke to an American Jewelers employee on the phone. He confirms for us that Rolex watches as well as Cuban style jewelry were stolen. I asked him, do they lock up all of their jewelry every night? He tells me that some items they do and some items they don't, but obviously things have changed after what happened on Saturday. Throughout the day, Mesquite detectives have been combing through surveillance video from cameras across the mall because the suspects even ripped out the security cameras from American jewelers. This area is getting kind of dangerous. Last Thursday, about a mile away from the mall, they had followed me after work. Tian Tran, the owner of Instant Cash for Gold, was robbed. Yeah. I was bringing some of my online stuff home. $75,000 worth of jewelry gone. Went to get gas and then went to pick up food and went to the grocery store. Right when I parked, went in, less than two minutes they broke into my car, straight for the briefcase. Just yesterday, Mesquite police took his surveillance video to see if there is any connection to the Mesquite Mall jewelry store robbery. I went back and looked at the video and yes, I saw a white car kind of just followed me. Just be vigilant. I mean, that's pretty much all you can do. In Mesquite, I'm Malini Basu.